2020 and the start of 2021 have been difficult for many of us to say the least. In my home, it's been quite chaotic and exhausting with a small child, a new, very frisky kitten, my work and all the things I need to do and all the things I want to do. Now that we are approaching Imolk, it's time for me to do some deep cleaning, cleansing, clearing and preparation for the growth that I wish for throughout the rest of the year. Mother Nature knows how to do this preparation for spring for new growth and creativity naturally and I've been listening to her wisdom. My garden which has now become a wild overgrown herb garden has been waiting for my attention. time and circumstances are allowing me to give that same consistent attention to the garden of myself. organize and prepare my body, my mind, my space, my home, my garden, even my tarot and oracle deck collection. I not only think of the seeds I want to plant in the year ahead, but more importantly those seeds that I planted in the past, last year and beyond. Those seeds that were neglected or maybe sprouted and didn't get enough attention. It may seem like a big mess happens when you try to organize and clean and prepare and then you see what's been ignored and neglected or hardly given attention to. But sometimes we need to create a big mess in order to create a masterpiece.
There's a book on my daughter's bookshelf called Never Let a Unicorn Scribble that fits this creating a masterpiece out of a mess energy, this alchemical process. And at the end it says all great art, and I'll put in here anything you create, starts with a scribble or a mess. If we don't scribble, if we don't try, if we don't make messes, if we don't have failures, we will never learn how to make our masterpieces. Thank you.